Hey, welcome guys to my channel. Today I'm just going to show you how to install Nagios. Nagios is a, like a free open source computer software application that monitors systems, network and infrastructure. Nagios often like a monitoring alerting services for servers, switches and applications. Even it alert user when things goes wrong and alerts them a second time when the problem has been resolved. It's a open source software so it's free so but I just want to show you they have a different flavors as well so here you can see they have a Nages code which is totally free which we're going to install today and the other version is Nages code plugins and code front-end log server network analyzer this is all paid so first of all I'm going to install Nages today on CentOS 7 so if you have not sure how to install CentOS you can see my videos on how to install CentOS 7 so let's start I'm just going to show you all step and the other thing I'm after completing this video I'm also going to put all that steps in a text file so you can copy and paste and run all commands so first of all let me check my IP address okay so let me try if I'm able to ping internet here we go all good and my IP address and this this one okay so first of all we have to install dependencies which we required so for that command I'm, I have to install yum install high dash y httpd php and then press enter so it's installing files Here you can see it's completed. Now we can s install the second step to add libraries. So the to add a library here's the command. Don't worry, you can find this all commands and the attachments of this video. As you can see it's updating a lot of files so we have to wait there you go so the next step to add a user error then we can add a group so please follow all commands one by one so it's easy for you guys and there is a patch here you go so after running this it's time to create a directory so I'm to create a directory I'm going to run command like make directory and then the folder on edges and then after creating directory I'm going to go into the folder with the CD this command so now you can see I'm already in Nages folder so now we have to download the files here we have a two parts we have to download Nages and the plugins to download Nages the latest version I'm going to install 4.3.4 here's the command I'm going to run here So you can see I have downloaded the Nature's file 4.3 and now I'm going to install like downloading plugins. So to download plugins, go to this website and then download. Even download. So you can see now I, we have to extract both files. To extract the Nature's file, I'm going to run command. So file has been extracted and let's try to extract plugins. To extract plugin we have same command but 
you can see my I have a different plugins directory name so that's it so it's extracted so after completing this all that steps we need to compile and install the files to the nages directory so the next step we will go to cd nages slash for punch so I'm in that folder now and then we can run this command so after running this we have to compile and let's try and make all I'm just going to show you all points so when you're going to install you, you can see same steps so I'm not going to pause video right now so you can see it's going to take 2-3 minutes So next we we'll make install all that which we compile. After doing this we have to install the script like make install so you can see the initial script installed. So the second command we have to run make install command mode you can see external command directly configured and the last one we have to run here make install config after doing this we have to install we ready to install the web component so to install the web component we have to do make install dash web con uh, yes six, uh, yeah it's file install you can see here okay so after doing this we have to create one user to log in like I'm going to create like a Nages admin and then to create a user we have to run this command you can see and then it will ask for the password I'm going to put password and then the read type password so user has been created now after that we have to restart the Apache setting to take effect so the command system start HTTP service here you go okay so now here's the part to install the second stuff which we already downloaded in AGS plugins so here you have to follow this step cd we have to go to the same folder so we are in the plugin folder which you already extracted in the starting and then after that we have to run this command you can see the group so it's checking so So you can see it's checking a lot of files so we have to wait one two minutes to make it computed
after this we have to unmake that set After doing this, we can do make install. So it's a final step we have to do. So it we have to make like an AJ star at the boot time. So that's a command. So we can write in the configuration file. You can see where the location user local then nages then etc. Then I am deleting that file like pudding. Here you go. So you can see as zero warning, zero errors. If now we can do last thing, check config at slash net. Just say all good, and then the last. Here you go. So everything is fine. We can start the Nature service now. So it starts. So now it's time to see if over Nature server is not working or not. Let me check what's the IP of my machine. IP config. If you see, it says 10, 10, 30, 59. Let's try. 10, 10, 10, 30, 59. As you can see, I'm not able to access this. There is one reason. The reason I'm not able to access, you have to enable firewall because firewall blocking it so that's very important point you will not able to find this I, I spent a lot of time to find the resolution how to make it working so here's the command you have to run firewall cmd permanent zone public and that's it after you run it you can reload the firewall there you go now if I go here if I refresh you can see yeah, my Apache server is running then you have to slash nages here you go so you can see my nages server is running so I have a like a version 4.3.4 August 24 2017 which is the latest version I installed it's up and running so let me move the window maybe you are not able to see properly one sec Here you go. Anyways guys, thanks for watching my video. If you like the video, please hit the like button and subscribe it. Thank you so much. Have a great day.